Welcome to the Muskegon Channel. I'm Gabrielle Butterfield talking to Bill Bailey here. We are at the Luge here at the um, Winter Sports Complex. And can you tell me a little bit about this? I know that um, it's quite the sight to see. It's really tall and I hear you go really fast. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. We've got 750 feet of Luge track here. Here comes the slide right now. Ooh. Sliding down the track, bumping around a little bit. <laughs> Um, as scary as that might have sounded there, it's actually a ton of fun. It's very safe. Um, what we do here is we have a learn to luge session. It's a two and a half hour session where we give you coaching. You work uh, one on one with an experienced luge coach. Then they take you on the track here and you get free sliding time for about two hours. We run a fun little competition. Everybody has a good time. We even have Olympic medals that we get uh -huh. About how fast do you go on this one? Uh, you could do between 30 and 35 miles per hour from our public start. If you go from the top of the luge track at Gramet Peak, uh, everybody yeah, knows Mark that. that's pretty high up there. Yeah, that's, uh, you got to be experienced to slide from there, but you could do about 40 miles per hour from the oh, top Oh, wow, that's there. really fast. Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> <laughs> so what can they expect when they come out here? What do they have to do in order to be able to set foot on this first? Yeah, well, the cool thing is this is designed for the first timer, somebody who okay. has never participated in the sport of luge before, which is most people. So um, all you have to do is sign a waiver that we require everybody to sign a waiver um, and buy your ticket. You come out here and we teach you everything you need to know, teach you how to control the sled, how to slide safely, and how to have fun. Awesome. And before we started filming, you were telling me about um, there was a local here, a, a local little, actually, that almost just got into the Olympics. Yeah, yeah. Uh, his name's Jake Hearns, actually. He's been losing for years. Uh, he started out here when he was pretty young, and now he's in his 20s, and he's been traveling all over the world with USA Luge, mm -hmm. and um, he's been competing internationally. He was very close to making the Olympic team. Unfortunately, he was about six hundredths of a second from actually making that team in the end. So we were a little disappointed about yeah. that, but super proud of Jake. He started on this track, homegrown, and you know he's gone on to some big things in the sport of luge. And other other kids, you said you start at eight years old, that they can come in here and there's a program that you work with that yeah. you can kind of groom them into exactly. into the sport. Exactly, yeah, it's our Youth Luge League. Okay. So we start kids as young as 8, 8 to 12 years old, and we teach them the fundamentals of luge. Uh, we're looking for kids who are coachable and uh, who have some athletic ability and want to learn more about the sport of luge. And we teach them everything they need to know here on our track. And then kids that are really interested in the sport, there goes another <laughs> slider. <laughs> Kids who are really interested, we actually bring them out to Lake Placid and train with the national team and they have opportunities to move up in the organization. That's exciting. Yeah. So if we're not quite um, adventurous enough to do this luge, what else do you offer here at the Winter Sports Complex? Yeah, we've got a ton of stuff. We've got cross-country skiing, you see our ski trails here, snowshoeing in the sand dunes and right along Lake Michigan, which is incredibly beautiful. Um, ice skating. We have over two acres of ice skating rink and an ice skating trail that goes through the woods. I was really intrigued by that when we walked through. Yeah. It's something, maybe if it wasn't so bitter, I'd, I'd try. <laughs> a little bit warmer day. It's beautiful though, it's lit up at it night. Is. It's, it's really gorgeous beautiful. out here. It is, yeah. Um, so when you come out here with your family, what do you have to do? Uh, you tell us what you want to do and we're going to make sure that you have a good time here. So. Uh, we'll sell you your passes. We'll get you set up with all the equipment you need. We have brand new equipment for our skiing, snowshoeing, ice skating. We're going to make sure all the equipment fits you well and that you know what you're doing when you Can come Can you bring out. your own equipment in? Yeah, absolutely. We encourage that. But just in case you don't have it, we've got some good stuff for you too. Okay, so how about if you're not a local? What if you want to come, say you're from Chicago and you're visiting family? Yeah, yeah. We have all kinds of people that visit us. Actually, we have international visitors a lot of times, That's too. Yeah, yeah. Well, we've got a unique attraction here. We welcome everybody. It doesn't matter where you've come from. We want you to enjoy the slice of Muskegon, this winter slice of Muskegon that we have. So, um, you know, we can get you set up with everything. Even if you've traveled from far away, we're going to get you set up with everything you need to have fun and have a good time while you're out in the snow here. Do you have any events going on right now that we need to know about? 
Uh, we've got one of our bigger events coming up this year is actually our winter triathlon. Now that's triathlon spelled T-R-Y <laughs> because we want people to try new sports with this. Okay. So it's actually part of the Meyer State Games. So there's okay. state games going on across the state of Michigan in February, kind of like the state Olympics. And uh, we are hosting the triathlon portion. So you'll luge, cross country ski, and speed skate as one event. And uh, you don't have to be experienced to do it. That's the cool thing. It's designed for families and for people who have never tried these sports before. So we're going to train everybody in 20-minute sessions, and then we're going to put them out there and have people compete against each other. And do you other. do that as a, like groups, or do you do that as like a single person? Yep, you do that. Uh, you compete individually, but you'll do that in age divisions. Okay, yeah. that sounds fun. Yeah. Anything else that's going on this, this winter season? Uh, we've got stuff going on every <laughs> week, and we've got this amazing weather right now, which we didn't actually have, have last, last year. year yeah. So we're just every weekend we're packing it up with luge reservations, plenty of skating and skiing, and making the most of the winter we have here. So how far in advance do you think that we would have to to res reserve a spot here? Yeah, if you want to get in on luge. Um, we have some really popular weekends, President's Day weekend, Martin Luther King Jr. Day oh. weekend. Um, those book up because all the kids are out of school. Out of school, yeah. Yeah, so those are hard weekends to get into. Other weekends for luge, um, typically you want to reserve your ticket um, at least three or four weeks in advance. Everything else, the skating, skiing, snowshoeing, we have tons of equipment, tons of trails, tons of ice space. So you can come out with no reservation at all and we'll get you active out here. Awesome. Thank you so much for joining me and thank you for coming out here in this cold weather and talking to me today. Thank I you. I really appreciate it. Yeah, you bet. Thank you guys for listening. This is Gabrielle Butterfield signing off for the Muskegon Channel. Mm -hmm.